Hey guys, Cage Saw here, back at you with another What's Sold video. This is week 45 of 2022, getting down to the end of 2022 already, I know. Um, not very good sales throughout the week. I had 23 sales for last weekend on eBay, which was really good, and some of these are part of that. <laughs> Frank Dew on Amazon, this sold for 19 plus ship. I paid 16, as you can see right there, I paid 14.99. Gonna lose money on that one. This sloth, I just picked this one up, uh, not too recent, not too uh, long ago, in a thrift store, I think, actually. I paid, like, 50 cents for him or something like that. He sold for 13 free ships, so I'm making a little bit of money on him. This set of Batman comic books, all of these, it's 17 total Batman comic books. You can see them. Um, they sold for $17. <laughs> Luckily, these will fit in a padded flat rate envelope, so they'll cost about 8 bucks to ship. They're free to me at this point, which is why I priced them at that. I put them all up for auction, and they sold at auction for 17 They got one bid, so they didn't really go up for auction. But last but not least, this IKEA Bulldog sold for around 35 to 40 bucks, free ship. But I didn't even know IKEA made plush. It's not in very great condition, but based on the comps that I looked up, that's what it was worth. So here I'm going to cut to my best sale ever. And this is a confirmed sale, so enjoy this clip that I made like a week and a half ago when it sold. Are you all ready to see my best sale ever on Mercari? Look who sold. It's Fergus the Frog. This guy just sold on Mercari for $950. That's nine five zero, Almost $1,000 for a stuffed animal jelly cat. If you don't know, Fergus the Frog jelly cat is the best jelly cat you can find. And this guy just sold for $950. Now, I'm not going to put this in a regular What's Sold video. It'll be in a What's Sold video, but he'll be his own clip. Because I'm not putting this in until I'm confirmed delivery and payment from Mercari. I don't want to clickbait y'all by putting it in the in a thumbnail that this sold for $950 and then the person returns it or does something else. They do have like 42 to 45 reviews on Mercari. So hopefully the sale will go through. If you're seeing this video, he did sell for $950 and it was confirmed. Needless to say, I was very excited about that sale. This is like a week and a half later after I got confirmed delivery on Mercari. Everything went through. I got the money. It's in my bank account now. I transferred it. It was like a transfer of like 800 something dollars, I think, for that one item. He sold for 950 after fees and shipping and all that. I'll probably make around $800 off of him because I only paid, I paid two bucks for that Fergus the Frog jelly cat. So yeah, needless to say, that's my best sale ever. I'm glad it was on Mercari because after three days, it's confirmed. eBay, you have, you know, 31 days or, or longer, depending on eBay's policy, to return that. So yeah, great sale there. It's sold like a week and a half ago, but I'm including it in this video. Here are the sales for today, Tuesday, I guess. <laughs> Two Amazon sales. Yellow Ranger sold for 19 plus shipping. I probably paid a dollar for her at Walgreens at one point. This is a while ago. You're not going to find these at Walgreens now. This Piggy, I got her for a dollar at Walmart a while ago. She sold for 29 plus shipping. One Mercari sale. This lighter, Zippo lighter, Poison Elves is, I believe, the name. It was new, never used. I got it for like 10 bucks at a garage sale. 88 with free shipping. eBay. This Hex golf club or golf balls. Hex Callaway golf balls. Sold for, I think, 24 with free ship. I paid like nine at Walmart. Pillsbury Doughboy. Sold for, I think, 20 bucks. I had a 30% off sale, and he sold for 20 I think I paid probably 15 for him, so I might might lose money on that. This is free for my mom. It's Kulabara by Ugg um, Coral Ombre. <laughs> Shirt, it's new in the packaging still. Sold for $29.99. What's funny is, this sold for 20 bucks. Best offer. They never paid. I relisted it for 30 and it sold. Scooby-Doo with Scooby Snacks. This guy, I think I paid a dollar at a garage sale. He sold for like 16 free ship, but he'll ship first class, so it won't be too bad. The next sale, y'all remember me picking this up. Bose Wave Touch 4. This thing right here with the pedestal. This sold for $575. That's right. Five seventy-five. That's two really big dollar items for this one video. Now the Fergus that I showed you in the last clip sold like a week or two ago, so technically it's not this week, but I'm showing it in this video. I didn't realize this was also going to sell in this video, but yeah, two huge bolos for one video. I'll take it. I paid forty dollars for this at Goodwill, and it sold for five hundred and seventy-five. Sales for today were not nearly as good as the last two videos where I had a $950 sale and a $575 sale, but 
Let's go through them anyways. Penelope, Penelope Pit Stop Dorbs Ride. This is from Wreck-It Ralph, I believe. This thing sold for like 32 bucks. I paid 30 so I'm definitely losing money on this. But at this point, I'm just trying to sell it, get it out of the way. It's never going to go up in value. Stan Lee Funko Pop as well. I should have sold this. As, as some of y'all know, whenever important or famous people pass away, their value goes up for stuff they have. So this thing at one point was going, probably going for like 50 to 70 bucks. I sold it for like 17 and I paid 15 for it. So again, it's a double-edged sword whenever you hold items, hoping they're going to have value and you don't sell them whenever you should. This little Lego Raptor, <laughs> this guy sold for 12 bucks. Free ship. I paid zero at this point. So it's just free money at this point for me. I don't remember when I got him or what I paid for him, but it's Sully with the tag still. He sold for like 13. Probably didn't pay more than a dollar. So some profit there for sure. And then three sets of these lights. This is Make the Season Bright, C6 Warm White Lights, a pack of three. So 150 lights total. I probably paid like 50 cents to a dollar, and they sold for 19 free ship. Moving on to Mercari. Getting towards the ends of these. Hopefully by the end of the Christmas season they'll sell. But Hello Kitty ornament for 20 bucks free ship. At this point, it's free to me. So good little sale there. I've only got, like I said, like five left out of the 15 that I bought. The last one is the best one. Dangles the Monkey sold for 45 bucks. This is the Shell TY Lux pattern. These are the ones that have sold the best and for the most money for me out of the Thai or TY Beanie Babies slash Beanie franchise. This one does have beans in the bottom. It's a little bit bigger than a Beanie Baby. It's called like a Beanie... I don't know if it's Beanie Buddy or TY Lux, whatever it's called. Either way, it sold for 45 bucks free ship and I probably paid 50 cents for it. Here are the sales for Wednesday slash Thursday. First up, this Seattle Seahawks hat sold for 15 bucks. I got this at a garage sale. I actually showed it in the haul. I paid a dollar for this at a garage sale. 15 bucks free ship. These Allen Edmonds shoes. I think I paid four for these at a garage sale. They sold for 48 bucks or so with free ship. So probably make around 20 bucks on those. Sonic Wacky Packs for 15. Free to me at this point. A cutie car. This is Pancake Cruiser, I believe. Yep, Pancake Cruiser. This one I probably paid like a dollar for, I think, whenever they had them clearance down. Two Funko Pops. Captain America. I don't remember what I paid on this one. Sold for 15 This was part of the Fun Days box. This is Freddy Funko as Batman. Sold for 70 bucks. so good sale there. It does have some damage to it, but I disclosed that in the listing, so they know that there's damage to it. I probably paid like, I think I paid 80 for a box of this one and a couple others. This one pretty much makes the money back, gets close to it. There's one other one, Carnage. Freddy is Carnage. It's worth like 150 probably once it actually sells. Two more sales for eBay. Grab Attack from Ben 10. Sold for around 15. This Dooney and Burke purse from my mom, so it's free to me. This one sold for 60 bucks. It's like a plaid pattern, but it's a satchel. I think that's what it. I don't know what exactly it is. I don't know my purses, but it has like a little a pattern of ants on it. If you can see like ants crawling, so it's the name of this one is Picnic. Really easy to use Google Lens to figure out what these are. Mercari sales, three of them. Well, this is one. I mean, two Mercari sales, one set of three Blu-rays. I've had these forever. Only listed them on Mercari, but they sold for 10 bucks. So hey, I have no idea where they came from. I don't know if what I paid for them originally, but they're sold. The co coolest sale probably is this Afghan blanket. It's a Maine Coon Cat. Picked it up. I think I paid three or four bucks for it, and it sold for 43 bucks on Mercari with free shipping. So it'll probably cost you know, 10 to 15 to ship it, but still, good find. One little Facebook sale, Butter the Cow, sold for I think 13 or 10 plus ship or 13 plus ship, somewhere in that range. I paid six. So yeah, no Amazon sales for the last day or two. I guess Amazon's going dry for a little bit. But hey, eBay, I had eight sales, so not bad. Here are my pre-weekend sales, starting out with Amazon. This Funko Pop Kane from rest, from WWE, I think, or some kind of wrestling federation. <laughs> he sold for 35 plus ship. I paid six for him at Walgreens. Tori, I paid six for this one as well. It sold for 18 plus ship. Best Amazon sale. Red Ranger Funko Pop. I got this for a dollar at Walgreens three or four years ago now, so you're not going to find it. But now that there aren't many available, sold for 60 bucks on Amazon. It's seven or eight inches long. I had as many Poshmark sales as I had eBay sales, which means eBay didn't do very good. This Coach Purse sold for 50 bucks. It was free to me, free for my mom. Luckily, with Poshmark sales, you can just put them in a flat rate envelope or medium flat rate boxes, which I'll do with this. 
the other Poshmark sale is this Tennessee sweat shirt. Tennessee is playing really well right now in college football. They're one of the best teams, so their stuff is selling. 15 plus ship for Posh. The two eBay sales. This Funko Pop is Super Cyan, if that's how you say it, Trunks from Do Dragon Ball Z. Sold for 52 bucks, free ship. I think I paid 16 for it originally. Best one is this one. Freddy Funko as Carnage. This one sold for 155 bucks, free ship. So shipping will probably be, you know, tw or probably 10, 15 bucks. But really good profit there. I think I pretty much paid like 20. Whenever you consider the one I sold in the, earlier in this video, the Batman one for... I think I sold that one for like 55 or 60. This one's for 155. I paid like 80 for all of them. So at this point I'm in the profit and I still got two more left to sell. But yeah, that's it for free weekend sales. Here are my weekend sales. Shout out LSU. Finally beat Alabama. First time I beat Bama since 2010 at our home field. Two sports slash trading cards sold. Illuminati let them eat cake and Quentin Rose. This one sold for like three. This one sold for six. They will ship out via eBay standard envelope. So they cost like 50 something cents to ship out. Amazon sales, Colin the Cow for like 35 plus ship. Paid six for him. Vuvania the Butterfly sold for 18 plus ship. I think I paid six for her. She was clearance down at one point at Walgreens. These two cow slash longhorns, Wilfreds, sold for like 18 plus ship. I paid six at Walmart. And last but not least for Amazon, this little tiny Tsum Tsum, it's like three and a half inches long. Sold for $18.99 plus ship. So good sale there. I paid 65 cents for that like five years ago. <laughs> I finally got around to listing it. That's why it took so long to sell. Miss Piggy sold for $28 plus ship. Paid a dollar for her. Mercari sales. Squirtle got this for free from my parents' house. I was looking at, I was at, over at their house. It's always fun to source at their house. Um, this Squirtle sold for $29 bucks free shipping on Mercari. He actually weighs less than a pound. This one did not. This one cost 11 bucks a ship. Also sold for twenty nine. Sold for twenty nine bucks. Cabbage Patch Horse. I think I paid three or four for that at a thrift store. And then Arthur, the alligator stackable squishmallow sold for thirty six bucks, and I paid. It says twelve ninety nine, but I think I got him on clearance for like five or six bucks. And I'll take that twelve ninety nine off before I ship. eBay. Rollerblades sold for like fifty sixty bucks. I think fifty five to sixty bucks with free ship. But they won't cost too much to ship. They'll probably cost twelve to fifteen bucks to ship those. This blow mold sold in this claws, the one that had the blown fuse. Speaking of blown fuses, my AC is not working right now, so yay. More money to have to spend on random house stuff. House ownership is not fun. <laughs> that blow mold sold for like 48 bucks. This Moana sold for 18 free ship. She cost like five to ship, and I paid like 50 cents for her at a yard sale, I think, actually. Kawaii Cube Wonder Woman sold for 15 free to me at this point this wells fargo horse was free to me sent by a friend sold for like six bucks i might make a dollar on it foco pups sold three of them sugar bear probably gonna lose money on that one it sold for like 11 so this one's over 35 i'll make money on this one but i will also lose money on this one even though it's a chase funko pup chase funko pups are supposed to be good right well, this one sold for 11 bucks, and I probably paid 8.78 plus shipping for that. So, yeah, not all Funko Pop, not even all the Chase Funko Pops sold for good money. Whoops. Santa Jack sold for 20, I believe, free shipping. I got him on clearance at Walgreens one year, and I think this might be the last item. Yes, this blanket, of all things, Novatex branded blanket with a leopard on it. You probably can't really see it too well. I don't know if you can or not. I don't want to knock over Miss Claus like I'm about to do. Um, but this sold for $110 for a blanket. Go figure. <laughs> that's the best sale of the weekend. And I paid like three or four bucks for that at a, a thrift store. So that's it for the what sold for this week. Thanks for coming along. Don't forget to leave a like. Come with favorite sale. Mine, obviously, for the video, has to be Fergus the Frog Jelly Cat because $950. It's a no-brainer. <laughs> and don't forget to subscribe if not subscribed. Thanks for watching.